मिस्टर राकेश गुप्ता डायरेक्टर कैमट्रोल्स इंडस्ट्रीज प्राइवेट लिमिटेड गुड आफ्टरनून सर वुड यू टॉक अबाउट कैमट्रोल्स रोल इन केमिकल एंड पेट्रोकेमिकल सेक्टर एंड हाउ आर थिंग्स अनफोल्डिंग फॉर यू दिस ईयर वेल बेसिकली वी आर ऑटोमेशन कंपनी वेरी स्ट्रॉन्ग इन टू मैनुफैक्चरिंग प्रेशर रिड्यूसिंग इन डिसपरेटिंग वैल्स डी सुपरेटर्स दैन वी मैनुफैक्चर डिसप्लेस लेवल ट्रांसमीटर्स वी मैनुफैक्चर रोटामीटर्स प्रोसेस एनालाइज सिस्टम्स वी आर ऑल्सो इन टू द टर्मिनल ऑटोमेशन वेयर वी डू द लोडिंग एंड लोडिंग ऑफ टैंक लोडिंग एज वेल एज वैगन लोडिंग फॉर पेट्रोलियम प्रोडक्ट्स एंड सो वी आर अ हार्ड कोर ऑटोमेशन कंपनी एंड वर्किंग फॉर अक्रॉस केमिकल पेट्रोकेमिकल रिफाइनरीज एंड वी आर number 2 in in the private sector or the non mnc company in the automation we are about uh, 350 employees and we see a good business uh, very booming business in across the industry especially the chemical industry petrochemical industry refineries everybody expansions are going on investments are there so we feel a good future and uh, yeah the after covid it was slowed down and now it's picking up again uh this year uh for this financial year what's the target that you're looking at and uh, would you talk about your manufacturing capacities and capabilities see we expect to do about 250 crores this year and, uh, and we have about uh, 350 to 375 employees plus contract employees and we expect to grow at least 10% over last year and uh, we have a large capacity at goa we have a factory of 100000 square feet so we are doing export jobs and we expect to do much more export jobs in the coming months because india is becoming much stronger uh, in the capacities uh, in the technical capabilities and i'm sure this will uh, go a big way we are already exporting to many countries in uh, in kuwait in middle east uh, saudi arabia russia and uh, now we are doing a big job for uh, lagos in nigeria so besides the indian market uh, global market is very good for us to to execute and supply so what portion of your revenue comes from exports presently it is about this year it will be almost about 70% uh, but generally it is about 20 to 25% so and uh, any future plans well we want to stay in automation and we might diversify into the the green energy uh, or the psa plants or hydrogen generation but that is on the paper they still not so what kind of products are you looking with respect to green energy and hydrogen basically into hydrogen hydrogen generation through to some means of uh, you know uh, either it could be a electrolysis or it could be making hydrogen fuel cells for automobiles or going into hydrogen but still just just think it because that's the future of the of the world to go to green that's what we are thinking and uh, uh, any new products that you are coming up not exactly not not really other than going diversifying out of automation